Elizabeth Craft Designs. In this YouTube, I'm going to show you how to use the transfer sheets and the transfer sheets you use to transfer the negative parts or the leftovers from peel-off stickers onto a project. So you have double use of your stickers. You can use the outline and you can use the negative part. So this is how you work with the transfer sheets using the negative parts of the stickers. A lot of our designs have really nice leftovers. So this is the image I used in an, another video, how to use the peel off stickers. And this is the negative of that same sticker. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to cut out roughly, don't try to do it nice because it only ma makes it more difficult. I'm going to cut out that image from the sheet. Then here I have a piece of the transfer sheet. What I would like to do, I cut up the big sheet in different sizes because it's easier to use. And when I take this off, I kind of cut off a small corner here because then you can reuse it easier. And I also, when I take it off the first time, I'm tapping it on my jeans one time just to make it less sticky. Now I'm going to cover my sticker. I'm going to take a bone folder and you're just going to rub it. And as you go, I don't know if you can see it on the camera, but you can see that sticker attaching to my transfer sheet. Then I'm going to lift it up. And now you will see my sticker will be attached to my transfer sheet. If it didn't catch it all, you just go back and push it towards that transfer sheet. So you pick up all the negative parts. It's that one. And now you place it on your cardstock. I'm going to take the bone folder again, rub it, and then you're just going to roll down that transfer sheet. And you will see your negative part will be attached to your cardstock. So that's that. And I can reuse this, so I'm just going to place this back on my backing from the transfer sheet. Depending on how where you use it, you can use it at least 10 times. Another way I like to use transfer sheets is with the word peel-off stickers. Because sometimes those words, they stretch and they're harder to handle. So again, I'm taking off everything that's around here. And in this case, I will not reuse it. So I will probably toss it. And then I have a strip of transfer sheet. You see, it's a strip that I cut. I'm going to lay it over the word. Again, use my bone folder. Lift up my word. There we go. And most of the time it leaves behind the inside part of the letters. If not, you can get them out, take them out later. And now with this particular word, now I can position it any way I want and it will always be fine. So I can put it on straight, I can put it in an angle, any way I like. So I'm just going to stick it to my cardstock, take my bone folder again, rub it a little bit, and then pull back the piece of transfer sheet. And again, I can reuse this one as well. So I can put this back where it came from. And then I'm just going to take the Elizabeth Craft Designs fine pointed tweezers to take out that little piece inside the B. And that's how you use your transfer sheets. I want to show you two samples. So this is one, so that's a leftover that I actually transferred on a piece of cardstock with the clear double sided adhesive from Elizabeth Craft Designs on the top and then sprinkled glitter around it, the silk microfine glitter and polished it. And this one I showed in the peel off video as well. You see, this is the leftover from this sticker, from this design. Thank you for watching this video. If you're interested in purchasing anything that I used in this video, you can check out the link in the description box below. And in that box, you can also find the links to all our social media. There's lots more fun things to find on social media. Thank you for watching.